how to enable USB boot device on a uh, P5Q Pro Turbo ISIS uh, motherboard. So first let's um, turn off the computer. So I'll turn off the computer first and I'll turn it back on and press on the delete key to uh, get into BIOS. So I'll press on the delete key on the keyboard. Okay, I'm pressing on the delete key and now I've got into BIOS setup utility. In BIOS, what you need to do is go into boot. So, using the go to boot, then go down to hard disk drive, press enter, and then on the first drive, press enter, and from the options pop up, choose USB sand disk cruiser or your USB drive. So my uh, USB is Sandisk Cruiser, so press enter, then now go back out, so press on the escape button, and then go up to boot device priority, and now you should see it shows USB uh, drive as a first boot device, so if I go back here, and I go back down to hard disk drive, and if I choose this one as a hard drive, you can see that when I go into boot device priority, um, USB does not show up. So that's why you need to go back uh, to hard disk drives and enable first drive as a USB stick. Then I go back, go to boot device priority, and here now I have an option to choose on that one. And I'll press on enter, and I choose that one, then press on F10, and I'll save the configuration. And now I plug in my USB drive, if I can find one somewhere. Okay, I already have a plug in, so I'll plug in my USB drive. And then I'll wait for the thing to boot in. So you can see here, it's press any key to boot from USB drive. And from the USB drive, you can install a new operating system. Thank you for watching this video.